Welcome back guys and now what we're gonna do is we're gonna focus on the other two maps the metalness and roughness maps so I think depending on how long each takes I should be able to fit them both in one video because they both work in a black and white gradient scheme so since there's no color involved it's only black and white so what we can do is as you can see I don't know why it's doing this uh, black effect, by the way, but it doesn't change anything. Oh, and one last thing I remembered is initially I told you to be on Lambert, but what you actually need to do is we need to be on Blin. So when you assign your material, make sure you press Blin instead of Lambert because that gives us color, bump, uh, and then as well as uh, specular and reflect reflectivity. So metalness and glossness. Sorry, metalness and roughness, which Lambert doesn't have. So let's go into Photoshop. And if you remember the very first video, metalness is a black is metalness in metalness maps means there are non metals and has no reflections, whereas white means it's pure metal. So this is what I use for Marmoset Toolbag 3. However, obviously in engines it might it might differ it might be the other way around um yeah so let's let's crack on and see how it goes oh so we can start off with so handle so we can say these this handle and this handle are metal so what I'll do is I'll actually no, let's not merge them. So let's do this metal first. So if you press Control U on your keyboard, first we have to make take all the saturation out, and we can play a little bit with lighting. So I might make that a bit lighter. Afterwards, you can press Control L for levels, and we want to maybe bring that the whiteness up, as you can see, not too much, like so. Oh, one thing I should have done actually is let me do that in the first actually is delete that background and put that there. Put that background there. We go. There we go. So that's sorted. Uh, so then let's do that again for the next layer. Saturation off. Make it a bit lighter because it's white. It's a metal. Control L. Bring in a bit of darks maybe a bit more mid-tones and then spike up the highlight um yeah the highlights so that's nice and white the next thing that we have is the leather leather isn't metal so control u <coughs> to uh, desaturate it and then maybe make it a bit darker like so and in the levels it doesn't ob obviously doesn't need to be pitch black and pitch white you need to find a moderate number so therefore as well as we need to bring be able to maintain details so something like that's not too bad this top part is gold so what we can do is first desaturate it then I might want to like so and then control L Bring up the lightness like so. That's okay. So then I'm gonna do file save as. I'm gonna call this uh, metalless. Save that PNG. Let's crack open Maya. So uh, specular color. Let's go into here, like so, file, metalness, and now you can see, no shine, whereas there's shine here, 